Hello dear students. Uh, today we are going to explore about prime numbers. So here you can see that we have written numbers from 1 to 100. We call it as a 10 by 10 grid. And now we are going to shade prime numbers in this. So for locating prime numbers from 1 to 100, we will be using elimination method. So I will be picking up the color yellow for eliminating the numbers which are not prime numbers. So let us begin with 1. So 1 is neither prime nor composite. So it will not come into this category. Now we know that prime numbers are the numbers which are divisible by either 1 or themselves. So if you look at the number 2, the number 2 is a prime number. So we will shade this as green. So number 2 is a prime number. So you see that 2 is divisible by 1 and it is divisible by 2. Only 1 and 2 are the factors of the number 2. Now look at number 3. But before moving further, what we are going to do is we will be eliminating all the numbers from the grid which are divisible by 2. It is very easier. So what we are going to do is we can eliminate 4, 6, 8, 10. Also, if you see the numbers 12, 22, 32, 42, 52, 62, 72, 82, 92. These all numbers are divisible by 2. So these will not be prime numbers. Similarly, in the column below the number 4, you notice the numbers 14, 24, 34, they are ending in 4. So all these are divisible by 2. So we are not going to select this for the category of prime numbers. So these are not prime numbers. So we will be eliminating all such numbers which are divisible by 2. So here you can see that we have kept only the number 2 so far because this is the only even number which is a prime number. Also it is divisible by 1 and itself. Let us move on further by looking at number 3. What do you think? Is 3 an, a prime number? Yes, of course. 3 is a prime number because it is divisible by 3 and 1 itself. So, as we followed the process of eliminating the numbers which were divisible by 2, so we would be following the same process and we will now eliminate the numbers which are divisible by 3. So you see that cut all the numbers which comes in the table of 3. So 3, 6, 9, then 12, 15, 18, 21, then 24, 27, 30, then 33, 36, 39, then 42, 45, 48, then 51, 54, 57, 60, after that 63, 66, 69, then uh, 72, 75, after that 70, 8, then 81, followed by 84, then like this we will be eliminating all the numbers which are divisible by 3, then 93, 96, 99. So proceeding further you will see that 5 is a prime number and then we will follow the same process and eliminate all the multiples of 5. 
so now we are going to shade all the multiples of 5 so 25 35 45 55 65 75 85 95 also if you see the last column 10 20 30 40 up to 100 they are already shaded so proceeding further we will see that the number 7 the number 7 is divisible by 7 and it is divisible by 1 so it is a prime number now you tell me what all numbers are there which are not shaded and they are multiples of 7 so we have to shade the numbers which are multiples of 7 and we have to shade them in yellow because we are going to eliminate them. So 7, 14, 21, 28. Proceeding further. 35. Then 42. After that 49. So we are going to shade this. Then 56. 63. Then 53. You will see we have already shaded the numbers which are multiples of 7. 70. Then 77. After that. So all multiples of 7 are shaded. Now, we are going to see what all numbers are left. So, the next prime number is 11. So, 11 is divisible by 11 and it is divisible by 1. So, shade all the multiples of 11. So, you see that here, diagonally, if you notice 11, 22, 33, 44, 55, 66, 77, 88, 99. So, all uh, from 22 to 99 in this diagonal, all are shaded. So, after that, we are left with 13. So, 13 is a prime number. It is, it is divisible by 13 and 1. So, can you see some number which is unshaded and it's a multiple of 13? Now look for number 17, then 19, 23, 29, 31, 37, 41, 43, 47, 53, 59, 61, 67, 71, 73, 79, 83, 89, yes, 91 we are going to shade because it comes in the table of 13 and the last prime number up to 100 will be 97. So, all green shaded numbers are prime numbers. So, how many prime numbers are there from 1 to 100? You can count. In the first row, we have 4. In the second row, we have 4. That is 8. Then we have 2. In the third row, 10. Then 12. Then uh, 3 more. 15. 17. 19. 22. 25. Total 25 prime numbers are there from 1 to 100. 